Merging is basically a process that automates trimming. Here you can see a sign base, which is just a rectangle and a circle. It would take quite a few trims to merge this into one object by just using the trim tool. This can be easily done by selecting all of the vectors, selecting the vector drop down menu, selecting merge, and then selecting weld. You can also see that there are various options including intersect, which will leave the inside shape. There is subtract, which will remove the inside shape. There is trim, which will basically make every section its own piece. Finally, there is expose, which will turn everything selected into separate lines. One thing that you need to watch when using the weld tool is internal islands. For instance, when merging some text that overlaps. This would take quite a while to trim, but the weld tool trims it automatically, providing that you follow a simple rule of not selecting the internal islands. If I were to just weld this, you can see that at first the option is greyed out. Now this is because the text is grouped and the weld will not work when objects are grouped together. So I'm going to do this and it will work, but it will delete any internal islands. To overcome this, what you need to do is ungroup all of the vectors by right clicking and selecting ungroup all, then select all of the vectors. You can then deselect the internal islands by holding shift down on the keyboard and selecting the islands. And this will leave the outside shape when it is welded to produce the desired effect.